chat is so weird. <laughs> this is really nice looking, by the way. I wouldn't mind a little bit of subtitles here, though. This is a horror game, by the way. All right, hello everybody, it's me, Klon. And we're playing Little Goody Two Shoes, a RPG Maker horror game. The prequel to Pocket Mirror, which we recently played on the channel, uh, Secret Lies in the Woods. Um, I think that- Little Goody Two Shoes. A little loud, okay. All right, it's a little loud. We'll turn it down. YouTube will be right back. Oh, good. They actually have normal ass settings this time around instead of like gaze and recall. Nah, just new game and load, please. I've got gamer brain, okay? <laughs> I haven't read poetry since I was in uni, okay? Okay, I fixed my settings, guys. So it's little, go little goody two shoes. We're gonna get right into it. I'm going into this completely blind, but this is the prequel to Pocket Mirror. If you haven't watched Pocket Mirror Golden or Trauma, my channel yet, check it out. We got all the endings uh, with some help from our channel artist, Vin. Shout out. She's great at this sort of stuff. Once upon a time in the heart of a remote valley, an elderly woman ventured deep into the woods in search for mushrooms. We won't be getting help this time around, though. Don't worry, guys. When all of a sudden, she heard a loud cry in the distance. My goodness! Ooh, those are some old-ass hands. Oh. Cradled inside was a inside a rope basket was a cheerful baby girl. Oh my, what do I do? You take it. Free baby. Nice. Worry not, my dear. I'll name you Elise. And so Holly and Elise spent their days together in the village of Kieferberg. Dude, I'm loving these little animations. <laughs> Damn. As both grew closer, so did their love for one another. Ooh. That was gross. Look, Granny, look! Oofoo. Well done, Elise. I see the giggling has not stopped. Not all bliss lasts forever, and as time went by. Yeah. <laughs> the giggles are back, boys. So did Holly's. Oh, oh, that's sad. I'll take care of you. I'll do whatever it takes, Granny. Don't cry, my love. You've always said you wanted it. I'm sure you'll cherish it for... <laughs> Granny! Damn, didn't even call her mom, eh? I love you, Elise.
Thank you for granting my only wish. Huh. That's a little concerning. Okay. Oh! Right into it, eh? For goodness sake, there goes my last match. For goodness sake! Oh, I'm so tired of this place. Wash my sheets, Elise. Sweep my floors, Elise. Elise, Elise, Elise! <laughs> oh, I'd show them. <laughs> I'd make them scrub my pots and pans. My shoes, even. Have them wipe down all my windows. Every last one. Clean out my hearth and fetch me some water. <laughs> Better yet, and have them running around and calling me Miss Elise all day. Oh, if only I were rich. If only, eh? <laughs> I love that. <laughs> That's perfect. All the steak I could ever want. All the shiny dresses. Okay, really steak? That's what you choose to eat every day? One for each day of the week, with shoes and jewels to match. And maids. All the maids I could ever want. Oh, if only. Well, one can dream. Elise? Wait, that's someone else. Oh, for goodness sake. <laughs> Wait, it's so, it's so cute. What the fuck? On your way home, lass. What are you doing wandering about in the dark, Elise? Oh, Ludwig. Dude, Ludwig reference. What the fuck? You want to know it's dangerous out here. I'm not wandering about, Mr. Ludwig. I've been working late, if you'd so kindly believe. You know better than to put yourself in danger, Elise. <laughs> If anyone's putting me in danger, it's you. I'd be home already had you not stopped me for an earful. Come now, Elise. We've got good reason to worry. All this vigilance. For what? <laughs> what am I to be afraid of? The witch? Watch your words, Elise. Watch your words, Elise. You're not to question such matters. What do you, what do you say we walk you home? I believe I'll be just fine on my own, Mr. Heinrich. Heinrich? No more det detours, Elise. It's for your own good. Lest I come across the witch, I know. Let us hope you don't come to regret your words, lass. Okay, chill out, guys. It's a fucking witch, okay? It's not like it's a murderer like you guys are. Oh, I can't stand these folks. Movement, interact, run, menu, okay. Speed! Nope. I'd best head on home before it gets too late, I suppose. Dude, this is great. Holy crap, dude, I'm loving it. It's completely different from Pocket Mirror, but yeah. Wait, was it? Hey. What about you? Seen any witches about here? Watching solemnly over passers by, passer by, the Lord's image rests eternalized in this wayside shrine. Oh, I, I thought that was a birdhouse. That is literally a crucified Jesus. All right, cool. Sh schwa? This thing's so faded I can't even read it. Left? Question mark? Question mark? Question mark? Right? Primal dwarf and up? Kieferberg Peaks. Um, uh, this way this town dude okay I don't know if we're gonna miss anything this game I'm like I said I'm completely blind oh she's so cute what the fuck dude it's so cute this game is so beautiful what the fuck and I thought our I thought pocket mirror was really beautiful for an RPG maker horror game I guess this one's not really RPG maker then but it's really good it looks amazing. Maybe it is. I don't know. I'm, who am I to say? This is really good, though. Red Nail. Hello. Pine tree this. Pine tree that. Everything about pine trees around here. Right. Kieferberg viewpoint. Left. Kieferberg peak. Wait. Was it left as the viewpoint? 
I'd best not wander about too far. Okay. So I guess right now I can't even explore even if I wanted to. That's fine. It's up Elise. Some of the backgrounds are drawn traditionally. It looks amazing. It definitely paid off. The effort. Yo, key. Item get. Acquired one grapes. That's kind of nasty, bro. I know, I know we're like in the medieval times. But you should at least be picking up the grapes off the tree branches, not off the ground. That's what I'll say about that. Okay. The game is in Unity. Love it a lot, though. And got me into Pocket Mirror as well. Opposite for me. I had someone for recommend me Pocket Mirror. Is that her catchphrase? Oh, for goodness sake! Is that her catchphrase, dude? It's impossible to keep this lantern lit in this wind. Guess I'll be finding my way home in the dark, I suppose. But yeah, this game is really great so far. Like, just art, style alone, music, animation. Save often. Make sure you use up all your save slots to avoid too much backtracking. Wait, what? Make sure you use up all your save slots to avoid too much backtracking. What does that mean? How much backtracking am I going to have to do? Excuse me? Is this bird rizzing me with a rose right now? Hey, yo. Save file zero, I guess. Yeah. Progress saved. All right. All right. All right, sure. Dude, that's a beautiful... What the hell? I suppose I have to chop some more wood soon. Just when I'd gotten rid of all those pesky splinters and blisters. Covered in aged scars. The tree, s the tree trunk sits bare. It's dry surface exposed to the elements. Huh. Damn, she really be living all for herself, eh? Yo, my door is open. Concerning. What in the Lord's name? Uh, that was a broken plate. I guess someone broke in. When the Lord's name happened here, I had to find my matches. <laughs> maybe you get a self-defense weapon. Just maybe. At least they didn't get into this trunk. Despite its visibly worn appearance, the old trunk keeps its contents safe and secure. I got a broom. Item get. Broom. That's a very old broom, but okay. Yo, someone's handprint is on my wall. I want to find my tinder box and light a fire. It's too dark to tell what happens here. Okay. Who in the Lord's name got into my house? What is this? I don't have time to tidy this mess up. Big shiny iron pot. Its inner surface is covered in scratches. Okay, but where are your tinder boxes then? The loom? Oh, thank goodness they didn't touch Granny's spinning wheel. Oh, good. Do I go upstairs? Maybe it's over here first. It's no use going in the pantry, is it? There's nothing to eat in this house. Oh, okay. No, I'm not leaving, right? I'm not leaving until I make sense of what happened here. Okay, it's upstairs. It's gotta be. Oh. Oh! 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 Dude, not, not the vines, man. Excuse me? What? What was that thing? Is that Leshy? I... Was I dreaming, or...? Nah, the struggle was real. The hentai monster's out there. What was I thinking, leaving it here? Okay, item acquired. Tinderbox. Nice. I gotta light the fire now. Use lantern. Oh, nice. Preserve your matches. Light your lantern using matches. Be careful not to waste them. Okay. Light the fireplace. I can go around. Someone loot my house. Really ought to go through all this junk sometimes, I suppose. Small wooden trunk filled with various knickknacks. Okay. Is this Granny's room? Who's in here? Endings? It's ten endings, bro? Ten endings? Whoever broke into my home must be out there somewhere. I want to sleep like this. Shuddering in the wind, the glass panes tremble in their wooden frames. They were thorny. Yo, it's a clock reference, guys. This thing's still not working, is it? I don't have a word with Mr. Wilhelm sometime soon, I suppose. 
clock's hands grant dutifully through time, struggling to turn with each passing second. Dude, why in these games am I never working? It's been a long time since I've gone into Granny's, Granny Hole's room. Not that there's anything to see there, anyhow. Is it Hole? Or is it Holly? Is it Holly? Or is it actually pronounced Hole, her name? Okay. Clean this up now? Uh, nope. Okay, chair. Who in the Lord's name got into my house? Oh, there we go. What Good is this? grief. What if it was that witch the townsfolk have been going on about? Yeah, witches just like to go in people's houses and knock a bunch of shit around. Together, but don't say least. granny hole. Oh, no. Oh, no. Kerm's making fun of me, too. No. Keep it together, Elise. It was definitely a burglar. Yeah, true. That said, I'm not going anywhere without my broom. Oh, we already got it. Very nice. I'm gonna smack some bitches with that broom. No, I can't go in there yet either. Okay, okay. Let's go through that door. Hmm, how long, ha how long has it been since I last used this thing, I wonder? Stringy cobwebs and dust cling to the old oven's wooden doors as though sealing them. Oh my god. We got the old ass clay oven outside. Jesus. Who's out here? Dude, is this Stardew Valley? This isn't the time to be watering the garden, is it? Weathered by time, the well's wooden structure stands frayed and worn. Speed. Yeah, what am I looking for? An in a burglar to beat them with a broom right now? Is that what is this? A chicken coop? What what is this? What is this? There isn't even full on stairs up. Hello? Wait, there's actually someone in the chicken coop. What the? Excuse me? Get out. <laughs> there you are, you shameless thief. Out with it. Give me back all you took. Uh, right. Hurry it up. Now. <laughs> Beating her with a broom. Wait, please. No. <laughs> please forgive me. We're just beating the shit out of her with a broom, dude. <laughs> no. <laughs> Explain yourself, you wretch. What were you doing in my house? <laughs> what is the sound effect? <laughs> Wait, please don't hit me. <laughs> Apparently, no. <laughs> I was just hiding. There were these men, and I. Hmm. I won't ask you a second time, thief. Hurry it up! Give me back everything you took right now. <laughs> I didn't take anything. I was just scared. Please, I beg of you. Well, we really messed up that hat of hers. <laughs> Show me your hands. Oh, but I... I... I didn't take anything, ma'am. Well, <clears throat> now show me your pockets and make it quick. Protect her at all costs. I keep telling you I didn't steal anything, ma'am. This is all I have, I swear. Coins and weeds? What are you doing up here in the mountains? Oh, that's... I'm a traveler, ma'am. Okay. <laughs> Turn around! Please, Elise, we do not need you to do that inspection, okay? I don't need that on Twitch. You say you're a traveler. Are you all by yourself? Uh, yes. Y yes, I'm traveling alone. I hoped I could rest for the night in this village, but... <laughs> Cough twice, please. <laughs> no, it's not happening, chat. I saw some people walking in the woods. It frightened me, so I ran to find some place to hide. I'm honestly in love with Elise right now. The fact that she just started beating up a small girl in her shack. Just on site. It was on site for Elise. That's based. Mm. To the hydrate! 
I thought we were having fun, chat. I didn't know it was gonna be like that. chat <laughs> oh. okay uh, uh. I chug the water when you hear the do the hydrate it means you gotta chug okay it means you gotta do a big chug okay we ain't messing around in the stream about hydration YouTube Make sure you hydrate it, okay? <laughs> Skill issue. Drink as much water as I do, and you're gonna have it all over you. <sighs> Be that as it may, you're still. Oh, but I. Oh, please forgive me, ma'am. I didn't mean to make such a mess. Oh, shush it! Why would you, would you stop calling me that? Uh, I'm sorry. For goodness' sake. Clock we clock wow. got we to a little girl. What are you even saying? For goodness sake. Hmm. Alright, well, I might let you go. If we can prove your innocence, that is. Oh, that's... See, red nail. There's hydrate checks, and then there's do the hydrate. That one costs a lot of channel points, so we really gotta make sure we chug a lot of water. These are adults, by the way, motherfuckers. These are adults. Vin approved adults, okay? And we're not sure if they're purely lesbian. Maybe they're bi, okay? But damn, these bitches gay. I don't know what else I can do, ma'am. Well, you can start by cleaning up this mess. <laughs> Is it possible that I actually didn't get, like... They're not children. And then you can... I'm sorry, I... Ma'am? I did it! Yes, that's it. A maid! Alright. Listen carefully now. First, you'll be tidying up the mess you've made. In fact, you can clean my whole house from top to bottom. That'll teach you not to go so storming into strangers' homes. I'm sorry, I... I... Ma'am? Complaining already, are you? Wouldn't you agree this is the least you can do? Uh, yes. Of course, I'll gladly do it, ma'am. <laughs> Good. And in exchange, I suppose you can stay here. But no more thieving. <laughs> Bro has never heard a high-pitched voice woman that's not that's not a kid. What the fuck? I'm not a thief, ma'am. <laughs> I'll be the judge of that, thank you very much. Anyhow, you work for me, and I'll give you a place to stay. Fair enough, wouldn't you say? Hmm. It does sound fair, ma'am, and it is very kind of you, but... <laughs> I'm not a thief. Uh. Fine, you're not a thief. Now, would you stop calling me ma'am? Do I look like an old hag to you? Don't I apologize? All right. My name is Elise, and you best remember it. Yes. I'm so sorry. I forgot to introduce myself. Okay, what's this? What's this girl's name? Selenic Wanderer, Rosen Marine. Okay, the reason I yelled that was because at the end of the secret <laughs> ending of Pocket Mirror, there was a note about Rosen Marine. I don't know. I don't know if I'm saying that right. Rosin Marine, Rosin Marine. Don't know. But either way, I'm glad to have finally met her. <laughs> it's a pleasure to meet you, Miss Elise. For goodness sake. Literally my catchphrase now. Just Elise is fine. Come now. You'll ha you have a lot of work to do. Yes, yes of course. 
Okay. Achievement! Discover the thief inside the granary. That's a granary? Dude, what? Speed! Speed. Can I go back in there? Is she still in there? Speed. Huh. I really love the different use of angles, like uh, camera positions and stuff like that. It's really awesome. Pocket Mirror had a little bit of that, but this, this one is really taking it up a notch. Really, really good. How could you even do all of this? Look at my floors. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Are you so sorry, though? Even Granny's plates shattered to pieces. What are you, a wild boar? I'm surprised you didn't break my windows and tear down the walls. Oh. Mm. All right. Well, huh. you know what you did. Anyway. Anyhow, here, take this. Wait, you're giving her a broom to mop with. Make certain you get in, into every nook and cranny you hear. Yes, ma'am. You're not editing my videos. Nobody's editing my videos. I don't even edit my videos, chat. While you're at it, you can sweep the chimney and clean up the fireplace, too. Oh, and wipe that stain off my wall and wash all my windows. All right. I want this place sparkling by the time I wake up tomorrow, understood? Uh, of course. Was there a little bit of an accent twisted on there at the end? Of course, ma'am. For goodness sake! It's Future Clock who edits them. He's terrible at his job. And I told you to quit calling me that. Uh, I'm sorry. Come. Come now. Let me sh t Come now. Let me show you the way to the well out back. Oh, but I... I, I can do it myself, Elise. Anything to make up for what I've done. Huh? Oh, oh, look here, lassie. I have no good reason to trust you. <gasps> but she's got a straw hat. That's cool. I didn't mean to. Every single corner of this house is to be absolutely spotless by sunrise. Dare to cross me even once, and I'll be having a word with the townsfolk. You hear? Chat's coming right now. Are we clear? Chat lost. Nothing even happened yet. Yes, Elise. <sighs> I'm sorry. I'll... I'll do my best. <laughs> Be careful not to wake me either. I have Sunday Mass to attend tomorrow. No, dude! <laughs> I'll keep quiet. Good night, Elise. Oh, no, dude. I haven't gone to Mass since I had to get baptized. Oh, no. Oh, fucking no, dude. Shit. It's best I leave her be. I just gave her quite the earful. It's something the matter, Elise? No, it's nothing. Okay, well, I guess we can just go to bed. Where's she gonna sleep? Oh, wait a second. I guess she'll have to sleep in my bed. Uh. Now you've done it, Elise. There was hardly a need to be that harsh, but still. I wonder if she's dangerous, or worse even. What if, what if she's the tentacle monster? She's the witch the townsfolk have been talking about. Oh, that too, I guess. But what would Granny Hole do, I wonder? She didn't raise me to be like this. I'm gonna say Holly, I'm gonna say Holly. That just sounds better. I even threatened to tell on her too. <laughs> what am I, a child? What's done is done, I suppose. I'll make sense of it tomorrow. It's best I go to bed. Okay. Alright, sure. Sun Suntag 1, Sunday. Yo, I got heart meter, I got a bread meter. What? Yo, the good old bread meter is based. It's morning already? Yes, that happens. Okay, they're not an it. It's a beautiful woman, okay? And she is an adult woman, going to mass. I can't be late for Sunday mass. Her father Hans will... 
<laughs> I love that face. Wait, it's good. You can't be serious! Good grief, what was I thinking? Uh. She's probably taken everything I own by now. Yeah, that was not... That was a lapse in judgment. Managing stamina, you will lose one bread for each time period that passes by. That's six bread a day. This bitch gotta eat six loaves of bread a day? That's a lot of bread, dude. What am I... What is popping up? Item menu. You can consume and use items through the item menu as well. Okay, but like, what did I see? Oh, it's just this. Okay, well. Great music. Hmm. So much for St. Walpurga's protection. St. Walpurga? Excuse me? Who the fuck is that? That's Mother Mary. I ought to have thrown you out long ago, lassie. Palms joined in prayer. The wooden statue of Saint Walpurga grants protection to the faithful. I guess it's a saint. Okay. The only saint I know is good old Saint Nick. Okay, nothing to see in there. Oh, it's like little singing. Oh my god, it's beautiful in here. Well, as beautiful as a shack can be. Honestly, it looks nice. Or maybe not. It doesn't seem like she took or broke anything, but... Hey! Rosen Marine. Wait, is it Rosen Marine or Rosemarine? Cause right there, it's... God damn, it's shining. All right. Some translation problems already going on, but okay. Was that her name? Oh, okay. I can't believe she tied it up and left just like that. Ah, okay. It's a little off. Her name is Rosen Marine, but we call her Rosemarine. But the English dub still says Rosen Marine. <laughs> Call her Bob Ross instead. No, thank you. Unless she starts painting. Pretty little trees. I didn't even give her anything to eat last night, the poor thing. Uh... No. Where could she have gotten to? Uh, in the pantry? It's no use going in the pantry. Okay. She's sleeping in the kitchen coop? No way. No shot, chat. Is she sleeping in that coop? The chicken coop? Sorry, the granary that for some reason we keep at the top of the hill? No shot, right? It's in the JP dub, too. Nice. Rosen Marine! Rose Rosen Marine. For goodness sake. There you are, you. Honestly. What are you doing here? I'm sorry. I I was intending to leave first thing in the morning, but I was afraid I'd get lost in the dark. Wait, I just realized she has a voodoo doll on her arm. What? Never mind. Come with me now. I'm sorry, I Are you taking me to the village? By the way, I recommend doing her route clock since that's likely the most canon one. I feel like you're heavily biased because she has purple hair and she's totally the witch, right? And I feel like you're biased. We'll decide on our own after we see the other girls, okay? You shut the fuck up, chat. You shut the fuck up. Are you taking me to the village? Who do you take me for? Some wretch? Forget what I said last night. Not exactly my finest moment. I... Mm. I didn't mean to be such a brute, truth be told. The note in Henry's room? Yes. Yes, so? And? And, Vin? <laughs> I'm sorry for what I did, too. For goodness sake. I got it. All of that's dead and buried. No, no, don't worry about it, chat. I, <laughs> I actually listen to Vin so much on this stuff. <laughs> She's like the expert. I, I, <laughs> I wouldn't be playing this game without her, so. <laughs> now come, I'm running late for Sunday Mass. Wow, Lisa's a bit, a bit of a giga chat, man. She just, she just announces it. She's just like, now, come. Damn. Yes. Uh, wait for me, Elise. We need to get her a new outfit, though, for real. Chat, she can't be walking to church like that. Gotta get your Sunday clothes for church. 
Oh, she's so cute. What the fuck? Fuck. Oh. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, she said flock. <laughs> I thought we were just walking and I thought she just goes, fuck. <laughs> that was perfect. Flock? That reminds me of Brigida, how she used to say, fuck. Fuck. The cutest little girl saying it. Is like, hey, something's wrong with that fluffy companion, Flock. I don't think goats have eyes like that. Or heads that big. <laughs> well, that's really cute, though. Where have you been? You know this goat? Uh, of course. Is she French? I swear to God, chat. I swear to God. We met on the same way to Kieferberg. We've been together since. Wow. Yes, we were. We were. Uh... Oh, he's the cuddliest little thing, isn't he? Mm. The cuddliest little thing, you say. Hey, it's free milk. Anyway. Elise, it's free milk. Keep that. Keep it. I got it. I ought to get going. Wouldn't want to be late for Sunday Mass. Uh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be back in a moment, Flock. Hmm. I have to say, you did a decent job tidying up. It is a really cute game. There's nothing weird about it. It's just a cute game. Did pretty much everything I asked you to. Oh, I'm so glad. I wanted to assure you I meant no harm, Elise. <sighs> Kept me up for hours last night thinking you'd. Oh, shush it! I get it already. No need to tell me. Here, have some bread. You must be hungry. Uh, yes. Nice. <laughs> well, thank you, Elise. You really are too kind. For goodness sake. Good grief. Do you remember I hit you with a broom, right? <laughs> Called you a thief? Made you do my bidding and whatnot? <laughs> Most folks would have tossed me right out the moment they found me, but you didn't. Hmm. I suppose I didn't. Anyhow, I'm heading out. All right. Don't wander about, and don't make a mess. Uh, of course. Hmm. Hmm. There's a French in there. There's a French accent in there. Instant, instant drop in like. I won't, Elise. Pursue your love interests. Talk to your favorite girl when you see a heart above her head to schedule a romantic date for later. Ten cent. But does that, does that, does that pull me out of other routes though? If my friends see that, they're gonna think it's Rule 34. Well, your friends have porn addled minds, okay? They're porn addicts, and they need to work on that, okay? This game's just cute. Not this one. Okay. I don't think I can save from the menu, right? Wait, I don't have a map. <laughs> Wait a second, I got ten, 10 coins to my name. Bro's got 10 coins to his name. Damn. Okay, well, let's, let's date her, I guess. Uh, before you go, Elise... Hmm? I have something to tell you. If you could come with me later today... What's keeping you from telling me now? Ten doubloons. Uh, well, it's important, so... I'll be in the back by nightfall, alright? For goodness sake. Best be worth my while, you hear? Damn, Elise. Damn, I didn't know it was like that with you, Elise. Damn. I, I promise it's nothing bad. We'll see about that. Damn, Elise just wants to get down and dirty right away. Romantic dirt dates are marked with the heart icon. Each date will skip one time period. Okay. Didn't they say I had like six though? Meet her in the backyard. Missing someone's date two in a, two days in a row locks you out of them. That's the extent of the system pretty much. Wait, but does that mean I can date everyone? <sighs> Would you like to revisit the game's tutorials? No, I'm I'm okay. I'm good. Let's save though. Does no one find this odd when God shines a light upon Elise? Hey, excuse me, who's in my tree? Excuse me? 
There's a man in my tree! Maybe those are just eggs with little dots drawn on them. Alright, I got a stalker. It's a good one. Uh, I think I can save over this. That's fine. No, two girls tops. All of them. Oh, okay. Well, I'm glad no one finds this odd that a bird is trying to riz me up every day and God shines his light upon me. I guess I do go to church, so that makes sense. I stopped going to church, so I don't have God's grace anymore. Technically, you can do three if you take a super extremely route you have to follow. Good for achievement hunting. Hmm. Uh, well, we'll see who we pick, I guess. For now, we'll pick everything, though. I'll get an earful from Father Hans if I don't hurry up. Maybe it'll be like the ending in The Witcher the Witcher 3, where you just end up with no one because you tried to riz everyone. <laughs> That's the best, though. Grapevine Bath. Current. Attend Sunday Mass. Later, meet Rose and Marine at the backyard at dusk. Okay. Uh, oh. So there's our house. What is this? Mario Party? Wh what? Viewpoints. Creek. Crossroads Village Entrance. Village Square. Village Inn. Stables. Back alleys. Windmill. Where's the church? Oh, that's the church right there. I'm stupid. It's in the Village Square. Zoom. What about that castle? But also just... Okay. What is this? Is that the pocket mirror? And the basket. Okay. Dude, what do we run? A grape farm? Check your objectives, romantic dates, and tax on the map. Okay. Alright, chat. If you plan things super well, you can get all girls not locked out by the end. Wow. That sounds like I'm totally gonna do that. Is it this way? This is the viewpoint. Maybe I can do the viewpoint, though. This isn't the time to wander about. Okay, never, never fucking mind. You're playing blind. Blind is a bat. I'm not so good at this kind of game. What does that mean, Vin? What does that mean? Pew, pew, pew. Hop, hop. Hop, skip, jump. <sighs> okay. So. Hey, what's that? Goddamn brimstone carved into the goddamn wall. What? Is that a save point? <laughs> this bird loves me. Reminds me of the crows from uh, from Paper Lily. Now that was also a very good RPG Maker horror game. Okay, so is it Crossroads? So I guess I can't go up here, right? It's just not even gonna let me. Yeah. Okay. And I'm assuming down is the same, so let's just keep going, I guess. My friends are gonna think I'm weird. I'm just insecure. There you are, Lise. Granny jump scare. Come here, why don't you? Oh god. At least she's got a cute cat. Steal the bread, though. Good day. Oh, sorry. Good day, Granny Gretel. On your way to Mass, I see. Anything to keep Father Hans off my back. I have some fresh buns. They'll cheer you right up. I don't know if seeing your buns are really going to cheer me up, Gretel. W why don't you take a look? Oh, no. I don't want to. I'm good. I'm fine. Lebkuchen's, Lebkuchen's Bakery. I'm sorry if I'm butchering these German words, guys. I'm, I'm bad. It's always lovely seeing you, Elise. Yo, what is wrong with her face? Dude, she's got a mustache and her cheeks are falling out. I'm selling? I'm buying? What, do, what, do you, what does this do? Normal items. Food items. I have a bread and I have a grapes. Ooh, grapes give you HP. That's good. That's good. Okay. Uh, key items. I can't sell anything. Okay. I guess I'll buy some bread. Anything else? Uh, anything else? Some pretzels, maybe? Um, I'm buying... What do you got? Matches? You sell matches? Why does the bread maker... 
Don't be mean to the old lady. She's so cute. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not seeing it. She kind of reminds me of the of the witch of like the witch in Ghibli films right now. And I don't think you're supposed to think that the witch in Spirited Away was was cute. Buy her mystic orb. Is that an orb or bread? That's true too. The male gaze. All right, dude. All right. It's not like that. Okay. The old lady doesn't have to be hot. Okay. You're you're sick. What the fuck, dude? <laughs> I've. I'm just gonna say this. It's the cheeks for me. Okay. It's the cheeks. I don't know many old people that have cheeks like that. Okay. You're fucked. You're fucked. Every time Vin tries to pull me down to her level, I I literally can't believe it. I'm, like, not even there. Oh, pretzels are good, too. Oh, it's one coin for this. I say I say we top off our shit to ten. We, we can't afford any bread now, so, yeah, let's just do that. Yep. <laughs> Ad break rip. Anything else? Some pretzels, maybe. I'm poor, Granny. Tell me if you need anything else, dearie. No, I have one bread. I have one grape. Oh, pet the cat! Need something? Don't forget to stop by the village shops for some helpful items. Spend your tea wisely. Your coins. Your doubloons. I just stepped on that cat. That's a little fucked up. I just stole some pre- Item get. Acquired one pretzel. Speed, speed, run away. Can I steal some more, though? Hey, yo. Hey, yo, can I steal some more, though, from the old lady? Like, I'm sure she don't mind, right? This silly old thing. I'll eat the, f I'll eat the floor pretzel. To think Lepkuchin and I used to spend entire afternoons taking turns on this swing. Secured by slightly frayed rope and covered with pine needles, the swing's wooden plank sways gently in the breeze. It's so depressing having to walk past this place every day. Smothered in overgrowth, the abandoned homes every nook and cranny is bursting with clumps of moss. Please tell me you guys aren't slandering me in the Discord right now. What's this? This one is still salvageable, I'd say. Several sunbeams peer in through the many holes in the roof, shutting light on its barren interior. Chicken? Free chicken? Damn. Not a free chicken. Dude, more eyeballs! What is this? Dude, why are there just creepy men? Excuse me? Chicken? Why are you on top of me? Pick up the chicken. Steal the chicken, Elise. I'm gonna start another coup. Please don't. Mrs. Lisbeth's apple tree seems to be doing well this year. Filled to the brim with apples, the barrel stands unyielding despite the visible gaps between its planks. No, no. Uh, steal an apple, Elise. Come on, do something. Steal an apple! These are for her goats, I'd wager. Resting atop one another, many blemished, discolored, and wrinkled apples await their turn in the table. Take one! Please! Steal! You, you're okay with taking a whole pretzel? Dude, it's so good! Dude, it's so good. Why is there someone glowing green farts? Store events. All store events are marked with the book icon. If marked by the, s the time icon, they'll skip one time period. Okay. Hi. Everything all right, Miss Linda? Oh, Elise. Would you take a look at my poor flowers? That windstorm nearly uprooted all of them from their pots. What windstorm? Has nobody told you? Why, you've seen all these branches scattered about town. I heard Brynhild's roof nearly came off. It was so frightening, I suppose. <laughs> okay. Pay me, and I'll get rid of them. Hey, sir. Might be best to seal our windows and doors, old Wilhelm. Just in case. I didn't ask for anything, in my defense. 
Uh, there she is, alive and kicking! Made it home all right last evening, I see. I did indeed, Mr. Bernhard. You folks have your hands full today, it seems. Folks were scared out of their wits! So you make it seem like a trivial matter, old Wilhelm. Oh, it was a sight you wouldn't believe, lass! Branches and leaves piled up against folks' doors. Entire treetops, some of them. For YouTube's sake, me and Daniel are bros. And I did nothing wrong. Surely that's a bit of an exaggeration. The alleys took a beating, that's for certain. Some say they heard the wind knocking on their doors. Old... Old jo Jochen... Jochen says it might have been that witch herself, but... Oh, here we go again. Here we go again. You can never be too certain, lass. Anyhow, I'll be heading inside now, folks. Let us hope for a better night's sleep this evening. May the Lord hear you, Wilhelm. Damn, at least he's a nice guy, I guess. I guess we'll finish chatting with everyone. Good seeing you, Elise. Oh, it must have been even worse up in the mountains. It wasn't that bad, believe it or not. Ah, that's such a relief. I'm afraid we weren't as lucky, sadly. Oh, I do hope nobody was hurt. We could thank both the Lord and St. Walpurga nobody was, but... Many of the townsfolk got their windows shattered and their roof tiles blown off. Damn. What about you, Mr. Heinrich? Oh, it was awful. The window shutters were ripped right off their hinges. I'll take all day to tidy up and fix everything. That's alright, dearest. The sooner we get to it, the sooner it'll be done. I'm gonna blow a huge firecracker out your out the window. Wow. All right, that's pretty nice, I guess. That's a good way to wake everybody up. I can lend a hand if you'd like me to, Mrs. Ariane. Oh, that's all right, at least. Come now, you two. We'd best get inside. No, I want to leave. I want out. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. There's so many cats. Let me pet the cats, guys. Mr. Wilhelm's been keeping himself busy, it seems. Covered in dents and scratches, the anvil's smooth surface glistens in the sunlight. Do this pog. Send a video. Please. This isn't the time to wander about. I'd best hurry. No, let's be late to church. My family always was. Everybody, don't worry about the bird. Don't worry about this. Pet the dog! It's a dog! What a mess. I won't be going through here anytime soon, I suppose. The game's pissed at me now. Stay away from me. I have things to do. Okay. Never mind. We don't have things to do. We have we have church to go to. This action will skip one time period. It's a firecracker. Nah, it's not a fire hazard. Goodness, Elise, you look dreadful. Good morning to you too, Mrs. Bertha. Fucking bitch. Oh, Dilly. Oh, I wasn't certain you'd come today, Elise. Why wouldn't I, Miss Odilly? Elma. My, Elise, you look, do look quite tired. Couldn't catch a wink, I'd wager. Frightening, wasn't it? Oh, it must have been dreadful up in the mountains. Mm. Not at all. Seems you folks had it worse than I did. My, now that's hard to believe. Yeah, it's gonna land on cement. Yeah, you're, you're fine. Do it, do it, do it. Send, send the sound file. There's no ordinary windstorm, I tell you. How so, Odilly? Oh, I've had about... I've had a... I've about had it with this nonsense. She's saying it came from the woodland. That's what. Okay, it came... Came from Ken. I count down. Okay, you two. We'll be right back. What am I counting down from? Ten no, Odile. It's no use entertaining such notions, my dear. You two, we're back. You'll see, Merrily, Merrily, Merrily. That's crazy. Yeah, for some reason we have a lot of worldwide viewers on this channel. A lot of Hungarians. We've got one Australian. Australian's cool. 
All I can see is we're running late for mass. Goodness. What does Kieferberg come to? The, uh... The Hungarian is pretty alright, too. Algerian? Yeah. The Woodland, huh? There's a British guy that likes math, so I kind of hate him. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Mostly because of the math. Just British Columbia. Another fellow Canadian. Poggies. Good morning, Elise. Will, what's up with her ankles, bro? What was that? Freya? What, what's she hiding underneath those socks? How are you always so cheery, Freya? It took so long. I thought you weren't coming. I overslept a little, I suppose. Can I really count them? I mean, they're not really... I mean, I mean... They're not really my viewers. They're just people you know. <laughs> Didn't get that much sleep last night. I mean, you introduced the channel to them, but I, I don't know. It's... Eh. Oh, me neither. And all because of that windstorm. Not even my little sprig could help me. Your sprig. <laughs> I keep a tiny sprig of lavender under my pillow, you see. I fucking hate lavender. I don't like that smell, bro. Sniffing it helps me sleep better, and it leaves such a lovely... Shh! Quiet, keep quiet, you two. Shut the fuck up. I'm sorry. I'm enjoying the priest's mass. Goddamn old people. Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Wilhelm. <laughs> I think it's we went to sleep really late and we overslept past the normal time we woke up, but it was still less than what we would normally have. I think that's what it is. We'd best focus now, Elise. Hush it, you. You're the one wither withering on, Freya. Whoa! <sighs> Ugh. Father Hans. May the blessing of the Lord, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit be with us. May the hallowed Saint Walpurga take heed of our prayers. Amen. <sighs> This sad Saturday, we will once again be celebrating our patroness, St. Walpurga. As you all know, preparations for the festivities are already underway. Let us all contribute to the best of our abilities, brethren. That said, I am aware of what transpired last <sighs> night. Several of our neighbors were severely affected by the windstorm. I urge everyone to lend a hand in clearing out the alleyways. Let us all have compassion for one another in these trying times. Mm. Let us trust St. Walpurga to guide our people and keep Kieferberg away from harm's way. Oh, dude, I'm dying! May the Lord be with you, brethren. Amen. Bro, this church all over again. I'm gonna fall asleep. Anything but that. I don't think it's a bit. I think it's a bit. Because firecrackers aren't actually explosive. <laughs> Excuse me? Is this a nun? Are we gonna... Is this... No way. It took you all you had to... It took you all you had to get out of bed this morning, I'd wager. Excuse, this is the other girl, isn't it? Why are her ankles fine? Sugary devotee, Leb Kuchin. Dude, this bitch got lesbian basically in her name. Leb. Very funny, Leb Kuchin. Please tell me your name's not Leb Kuchin. We love Leb. I'm not gonna lie, best girl is already the maid, the, the witch. It's already best girl. It's already decided, I'm sorry. I know I complained before. Best girl's the, the witch. I'm sorry I complained. I didn't mean to. Apparently. Jokes aside, Elise. Don't I keep telling you to take your apron off for Sunday Mass? I'm certain the Lord couldn't care less. So why should you? <laughs> Wait, that laugh? Wait a second, the laugh, though? 
You're riling me up on purpose again, Leb. <laughs> Can you tell? For goodness sake. <laughs> oh, for goodness <laughs> sake. I'd best get to work now before it gets late. See you later, Elise. Yo, that English voice, though. Don't forget to come about later, Elise. <sighs> I won't, I won't. Unlocked relationship menu. Yeah, if you do join the Discord, just know, don't don't talk about your actual life. Don't don't like put pictures of yourself or anything. Don't don't dox yourself. Don't yeah, this is weird, man. Don't do that. It's good for your own safety. Relationships menu. Check the relationships menu to track your suspicion levels at any time. Excuse me? Suspicion levels. Relationships menu. Open the locket to check on your romantic relationships with Rosen Marine, Fre Freya, and Leb Kuchin. Okay, it's definitely Rosen Marine. I'm not gonna lie, chat. Can we loot the church? No wonder Father Hans is such a miserable wretch. It would be too if I had to read this gibberish all day. Father Hans's holy scripture rests upon the altar, each page scrolled with annotations. This must be Leb Kuchin's Bible. Let's see. No, I can't do it. It's so tedious, I can't get past the first sentence. Me. Give me the TLDR. Copy the Holy Scripture rests upon the altar. Okay. What's this? St. Walpurga, huh? Basking in its holy glory, the image of St. Walpurga solemnly watches over Kieferberg Church. Okay. I don't want to leave yet. We best send word to Primeldorf before at least and see there. Send word to Primeldorf, Mr. Gustav. We're having fo we're having folks from Primeldorf lend a hand with the festival this year, Elise. I heard the windstorm wasn't as bad up in the mountains, lass. Freya was fretting over you like you wouldn't believe. She was. You ought to thank the Lord for your good fortune, Elise. Certainly, Father. Hard at work even on a Sunday, are you? When aren't I, Father? Sundays are meant for rest, Elise. You let us know if you ever need a hand, you hear? Of course. Mr. Gustav, thank you. Wait, Mr. Gustav, the Giga Chad? The good neighbor? What the hell? Okay, let's get our other date, I guess. Couldn't sleep much last night, could you? Could you? Didn't sleep a wink. Explains the hilarity. What? You're hopeless, Lebkuchen. As long as you keep indulging me. So it's my fault, huh? How am I dating a nun? I just realized, how am I supposed to date a nun? Here you go, before I forget. There's nothing weird about this game. It's just a normal game. It's just a game, man. It's just, I don't know why you guys think it's weird. She just gave me a pretzel. She just bribed me with food. To go in it. Oh, you brought my f you brought me my favorite. Mr. Bernhardt said you were rather late getting home last night. Is that so? I did tell you it was almost time for supper when you stopped by. I told you Mrs. Alma worked me like a donkey right up until nightfall. Mr. Bernhardt was fretting over you is all. Mr. Bernhardt can find better things to do with his time, I'm certain. Leb is basically a sweets dealer, and I love her for that. But she handed me a pretzel, and that's salty. Don't get me wrong, I love that. But I think you're wrong. Anyhow, it's about time I head out. Say, I'll be up at the bell tower all afternoon if you'd like to keep me company. Snacks dealer. <laughs> I'll be there, Leb. Will I? How does this work? What's the time? What is the picture? Next in the story, attend Sunday Mass. Wait, next in the story? What do you mean, next in the story? Oh, no. At dusk and in the afternoon. So for right now, for right now we gotta help with the chickens and help Elma with the apples. Okay. Alright, sure. 
What is this? Excuse me? Acquired a mysterious note. Why is brimstone written on the note? <laughs> what? There's something written on here. Leb's your second favorite? Please stop referring to your age beyond the arcade. I'm sorry to say, it's just not a good idea. Hallowed while Perga sanctified by thy name. May thy will be ever may thy will be everlasting and thy grace all embracing. Quench thou shall be on this Sabbath on the full moon. May this prayer find its restful place in thy life, bearing grove. A prayer? There's something else at the bottom. Kieferberg's offering lies in the crossroads beyond the maypole. May thy thirst be quenched, thy blessings received. In the crossroads? I wonder who dropped this. <laughs> Brimstone. I'm pretty sure that's brimstone, right? That's like a demonic symbol. Or like a satanic symbol, I guess is the best way to put that. Wait, let's let's loot. Loot, 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 loot. Did I go through there? I remember sneaking to Father Han's study with Leb when we were children. These two rooms have nothing but junk in them anyhow. I guess we are kind of satanic if we're going to try to make a nun date us. It's pretty messed up, honestly. What's back here? I remember sneaking... Oh, okay. These tubes have nothing but junk anyways. Wait, there was stairs. Fuck. For goodness sake. <laughs> For goodness sake. Thank goodness that's over. What a bore. Fleta is your second favorite? Nah. Nah, it's over, Red. I don't know about that one. I think I'll have to work all day until the evening. That's nuts. Each day is six time periods, but only three are working periods. Morning, afternoon, no dusk. Okay. Time periods, all goals marked with the time period icon. We'll skip one time period. Okay. Ah, Elise, I was waiting for you. It was a good run, Red. It's nice to meet you. Waiting for me? I almost forgot to give you this. Ointment. That's kind of an odd gift, but okay. You mentioned your hands were feeling dry, right? Am I playing a guy? Excuse me? What? What am I doing with my hands? Oh, you didn't have to, Freya. Excuse me, Freya? I use it right before bed every night. It does wonders for the skin. I don't want to know. T TMI. TMI, Freya. TMI. Put a little lavender in there, too. Well, that's actually quite nice, though. Wait, you made this yourself? Of course I did, silly. That's Papa's favorite. His hands are always dry, you see. Went from a smile to... Why is your Papa using so much hand cream? Huh? What, what else is on his nightstand? A roll of toilet paper, too? A box of tissues? You do have a knack for this sort of thing, don't you? Uh, so I'm so I'm told, I suppose. Anyhow, I best move along before it gets late. Say, Elise, I was wondering. I'm going to pick some flowers this afternoon up in the mountains. Flowers. Thought maybe you might care to join me. That sounds so boring, bro. If you'd like. All right, I'll I'll be there, Freya. Ah, uh, th that's wonderful. Have a nice day, Elise. But I'm just, I'm, I like friends, so I guess I'll say yes. What's gotten into her? Save. I feel like we're stretching ourselves thin here. Is this like just favorite games? Damn. So what, what have we got going on? So... Dusk, afternoon... Okay, so we already have to choose between the two of them for the afternoon. Don't we? For the date? But at least we can choose two. We can choose two. 
So who are we, who are we gonna date, Freya or Lebkuchen? Okay, first let's uh, investigate the notes you found. What do you mean, investigate the notes? Key items? Something written on here. We already read this. I can like do that now, right? I can just go. Is this gonna cut time though? If I start doing this? I saved, I saved, I saved, I saved, I saved, I saved, I saved. Look at all these old ass people. Where did I come from? Here. Oh, okay. Wait, I actually really like that Pocket Mirror was like very, like, not, didn't like tell me the story outright. Is this, right? Is this. Uh, like I had a lot of fun. Like I had, I actually really enjoyed like talking with uh, Vin about the story and like chat. Like I really enjoyed like figuring it out, like piecing it together. That was a lot of fun. Was this opening here before? I wonder. This place is so stuffy. Uh, stay sane. Keep Elise from feeling frightened with sanity healing items, or she might go mad. Well, I, I'm not illiterate when it comes to media, okay? Pretty. I like to think I'm a pretty smart guy. Item get. Acquired one times. Diary entry. Nice. Someone's diary. For free. <laughs> hey, chat. Chat, let's pop our ego. Vin just said we're smart. Hell yeah. <laughs> this looks like an... This looks an awful light light light. <laughs> okay. Immediate stroke following. This looks an awful lot like that old geezer's robe, doesn't it? What's this? The miracle of our beloved patroness, Saint Walpurga. After last evening's events, I have no choice but to take responsibility. Not only for Saint Walpurga's sake, but for Saint Old Holly's as well. Huh? Granny Holly? For her sake? On her deathbed, Old Holly confessed to all her sins. What? What was her sins? Among her most mundane missteps, she told me of Elise. What is a sin to of her many prayers to cure her of her childlessness? Yet what struck me as remarkable was the miracle she claimed she was granted. That the woodland itself granted her wish for a child. I mean, someone could have just thrown a baby in the woods. Yeah, I don't think it's like that. I don't think it's like that beyond the arcade. Vin's a homie, though. As she put it herself... Granted her wish for a heavy price. How can this be? What did old Holly truly mean to say? I'm also not chats either. Okay. Sorry to tell you, chat. Sorry to tell you. If this truly did happen, and Elise was conceived by St. Walpurga's divine intervention. Yet if not for St. Walpurga's blessing, then who is he? Old Holly didn't seem delirious, nor did she lose her composure... I have more questions than I can answer at this moment. You're disgusting, Ben. You get your fucking head out of the gutter. What is going on here? Good job, Kerm. Keep it up. I'd best hold on to this piece of paper. Item acquired. Tatter note. You've been reading way too much AO3, okay? Calm it down. It's just freaking... It's a piece of paper! Ah! Another prayer. Hallowed Walpurga, sanctified by thy name. I beg thou for a sign, a testimony to my plea. May you accept this offering, the remnants of thy miracle. Kieferberg welcomes thy blessings, thy guidance. Mm. Someone must have been leaving these around, but who? Something else at the bottom. Find proof of our faith up at the peaks. Buried within the windmill that once was. Hmm. This is that old windmill up in the mountains. What? So now I gotta go to the windmill? Uh, uh, why is there a cave-in happening? Ugh! Oh, uh, oh, oh, oh my god! Ew! Why is it doing that? Wait, what? A door. It's locked too. What is this place? 
man-sized sigil appears chiseled into the door's gritty surface, surrounded by uneven scattered crevices. Why does he look like the pleb? The little pleb monster. Ew! Ugh. Am I pushing rock? What? Where'd the guy go? What? Wait, it's, it's something in there! No. No. No, wait, what? Did I mess up? What? What was that thing? I... Was I dreaming, or... I think it might need something to clear my mind. Is that... So did the time pass there, or is there still time? So there's still time. Also... Investigates the notes further later. Well, it said I it said this old windmill like I can go there, right? Like can I go to the windmill right now? Like can I do that? Or is that actually for later? Best not wonder about too far. Or am I gonna get hit with that? No, I got two of them. I, I saved two of the girls. I saved two of the girls. I did a good job. It was only, um... It was only one of the girls I messed up on. Shit, I kind of forget her name. My bad. It wasn't Lisette. It was, um... Fuck. Too many names. Harpe! There we go, Harpe. Sharpe, Harpe. What is this? The windmill that once was. This is it, surely, but I can't move this out of the way. Maybe we should come back some other day. Shut the hell up. Do it now. Holy crap, good view. Goodness knows what I would give to live in a castle just like that one. Yet here I am. Simple maid of all work. Shining in the distance, the monumental castle stands ephemeral and out of reach. It's great to see more about Elise, though. I uh, That's why I'm really interested in playing this game. Just kind of get more of the story, I guess, if that makes sense. Oh my god. Imagine if I got an offer for voice acting. Nah, I, I've got a shit voice. We stay losing, boys. Okay, but like... Once again, Vin. You're the one with the dirty mind, not me. That's what I'll say. That's what I'll say. Pet the cat. Pet the cat. Pet the cat. Pet the cat. Not happening today, huh? Oh, to believe that windstorm ever happened. There's no wits. You've seen how jittery she is this morning. I can see why this game takes a long time to beat. Can't be good for her health, that's for certain. She's always been rather anxious, you see. All this nonsense about the witch and the woodland is only making it worse. So you think it's nonsense too, Mr. Wilhelm? Not one to believe in such things, but old Jokin seems to know a thing or two about this witch he speaks of. Oh, for goodness sake. One can't know for certain, lass. She could be out there for all we know. Best make certain we all check under our beds tonight, then. Here's to hoping you don't come to regret your words, Elise. Harpe stressed me out, Lol. Harpe's cool. I like Harpe. Best girl. Well, that's a close second. Okay, but does talking to everyone actually matter? That's so good to see you, my dear. I've been fretting all morning. I'm all right, Mrs. Elizabeth. Thank you. I heard from Ludwig you were late getting home last night, Lise. I thought gossip is supposed to be a sin. I mean no ill will, my dear. I'm hungry, Mama. Let's go home. Settle down, Angelica. Can't you see I'm talking to Elise? Folks have been keeping me later and later lately. I can talk some sense to them for you, my dear. You have more than enough on your plate as it is, Miss Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Not at all, Elise. I'm glad to keep an eye on you. You're always too kind, Mrs. Elizabeth. Mama, hurry up! <laughs> True. All right, all right. True enough. True enough as a kid. You gotta wait for your... 
fucking parents to finish their talking. Didn't I get platinum? I think my first ending was platinum. I didn't even I didn't even get one of the bad endings, chat, in Pocket Mirror, okay? I didn't that was I had to get those later, okay? That's how good I am. Can I leave Kieferberg over this nonsense? Leaving? Who's leaving? Or at least it's that witch folks keep wittering on about. That windstorm couldn't have been a mere coincidence. Old Jokens. Calm down, Brunhild. Think of your baby. And I'm not one to believe such things, but I didn't. That was later. That's how good I am. See guys, I beat Pocket Mirror on the first try, without any of the bad endings. I had to go back for those. That's how good I am at games. I thought you weren't buying into this nonsense, Mrs. Bertha. Why, who are you to say it's nonsense, Elise? Oh no, dude. Wait, does this matter? Wait, does this actually matter? Wait, like, does I... I guess we'll be a little polite and say you're just jumping to conclusions. Because if I say it's nonsense, that's kind of rude. Yeah, don't spoil. Don't spoil, but kind of spoil. A little bit. Just, just a little bit. Vin? Vin's on my side, so we all win. We all know old Jokin's making too much of it as usual. Oh, I hope you're right. Of course we do, Elise. It's just... Last night was so frightening, it left us all wondering. I understand, Mrs. Dorothea. Yet fretting like this isn't... Worrying like this won't get us anywhere. Truly, Mrs. Bertha, you're right. For goodness sake. Wait, what do you mean, you're playing that way? You already are helping. Lepkuchin and I used to play about in the water all the time, didn't we? But we're a little too old for that now, I suppose. Furthermore, decorated with blooming flowers, Kieferberg's crest rests atop the square, mount qu square fountain in its ancient glory. Huh. Yeah. Who are you? Can't stay- can't be bothered to lend a hand in the alleys, at least. Folks can look after their own homes, I'd say. Sparing yourself on a Sunday, I see. As a matter of fact, I have to work every Sunday, Mrs. Lurley. Alright, alright. Whatever you say, lassie. Say, have you seen my niece by chance? Molly? I'll take it you haven't then. No, I don't think I have, Mrs. Lorelei. It's been up to no good lately, you see. Running about begging for food, skipping class. Who knows what else? I see. Nothing a good whipping can't fix anyhow. I wouldn't be so certain. Okay. I actually don't know what I'm doing at all right now. We're just we're just gaming, man. We're just talking to everybody. We're gaming. Gossiping with the old ladies now. You've seen what it did to the alleys, Mary Lee. Oh, Dilly, what are we to do with you? Is everything alright, Mrs. Mary Lee? You're asking about spoilers. <laughs> That's fine. You don't have to spoil that much. I don't care that much. Modelli oh, here is making too much of that windstorm is all. You'll see, Merrily. See what, Mrs. Odely? Old Jokin's right, lass. That windstorm came from the woodland. It's just that wretched rich. For goodness sake. How many times am I gonna say that throughout this playthrough, man? <laughs> You'd best keep such thoughts to yourself, Odely. The townsfolk are already frightened. You wouldn't want to make it worse. I am simply trying to alert folks to the... You have to watch your words, dearie. That's what happens when you try Mr. Mrs. Merrily's patience, I suppose. That's like a hint, isn't it? Time for work! Okay. Leaves. <laughs> no. Uh, okay, so we can work for her. The better you do, the better your reward. Do your best and spend your money wisely in the shops. Okay. I feel like that actually was like, they're telling you like, hey, like, do a good job. And then this is their way of saying like, you better fucking do a good job or else you lose the game. I'm so happy. I'm so glad you dropped by at least. Won't you lend me a hand? I have my hands full tidying up after that windstorm, you see. I can lend you a hand with that, Mrs. Ariane. I was hoping you could fetch me some eggs from the coop. Of course. Oh, it's going to cost a bread. Leave it to me, Mrs. Ariane. Careful with the hens now, you hear? 
I dare say they're still riled up after last night. Out of my way, you feathered rat! What? Chickens? Chicken Frenzy! What is this, an arcade game? Excuse me? What's happening? Move. Pick egg. Oh, okay, that's pretty basic. Excuse me? I thought this was a Medieval Times game. <laughs> that's good. cute. What the fuck? Oh, I fingered that kid. I fingered the chicken. No, stop doing that. No, dude, what? Move, move. It's fucking chicken, bro. Oh, one more. No. Okay, was that good? Was that good? Oh, there's more rounds. There's more rounds. There's more rounds. Come on, move, you fucker. Come on. Fuck. No! Move! <laughs> What is this even supposed to mean, man? Did I actually just finger a chicken? I did not say anything other than that. Score 32, rank B. Dude. Dude. Try again. Why would I... No? Is that bad? What did I do? What did I... Did they bite me? No, I guess not. I, I'm gonna have to stick with the B. Is it worth it? Why would I spend money to make it? It's a decent score. Does it only go to A or is it like most games where, like Japanese games where they go to S? Oh my, these days, these will hardly do, Elise. How many eggs do you need? Heinrich's going to be rather disappointed, the poor lad. How many eggs do you fucking need, bitch? I grabbed like 22. That's a big ass omelet. For your time, Elise. First time I've ever seen a bee on chicken. Good effort. What the fuck? <laughs> Thank you, Mrs. Ariane. Dude, I don't know what I'm doing, okay? Shit. So we're eating a bread, and now it's after... It's dusk or afternoon. Okay, it wasn't that hard. I was just surprised, okay? Sheesh. Oh, dude, please! Why don't you pet the cat? I mean, I didn't have too much trouble, but I don't know how fast you can really do it, because... Because, like... Like, do you even move? Is there a point to moving? Like, should you just stay in one spot? Like... I don't know. Okay, so... Now... So now we can either keep working or we can go on our date. Who should we bother going on a date? Chat, what do you want to see? Do you want to see me chop some wood or help some chickens or do you want to see me go on a date? Get that riz working, you know? I guess we should eat that piece of bread too. Cuz we're kind of low on food. But not health. So bread. Eat, I guess. Have some lunch. Yes, bother going on the dates. Imagine not going on a date. I can't. <laughs> well, I'm not a loser, chat. So, I've been on lots of dates. Okay. Who do I go with? I guess Freya. I guess I prefer Freya right now over Lepkuchen. But where's Freya? Zoom? Dude, why is she all the way over here, dude? What is that? Bro? Okay, let me save. Did I even get paid for that, by the way? Yeah, we can save. That's fine. I guess I could have reloaded the save and done better, but I don't give that much of a shit. Oh, it's like different now. People are in different spots. Did they say anything different? 
More good than bad coming our way, good willin'. God willin'. Best keep a positive outlook, Ludwig. The festival's a weeks away. Are you still talking about the windstorm? I mean, the last has had enough of that, you see? Old Jokin's right, Heinrich. It was more than a mere windstorm. <laughs> what the fuck? I've been on lots, okay? With Ginger. You guys speak for all of Kieferberg when I say it's better to be safe than sorry, that's all. Spreading this nonsense about town is doing more harm than good, Mr. Ludwig. I have to agree to old Olderly's losing her wits. But the Hans can have a word with her later. All of, as for us. I don't know. I think so. Kind of? I don't know. We have to act before it's too late, and we'll never hear the end of it. We could have gotten more. I'll agree on that. The little kids, what's up? Elise, Elise! I'm busy. Shoo, shoo. Wait, you gotta up your game? Wait, what did I- Okay, what did I get? You gotta up your game? You got paid 40. Fun fact, I believe you used to get paid less for any rank that wasn't S, but in an update, they buffed payouts. She was getting paid 30. How much did he pay you? I gotta see. You're so boring, Elise. Or, you're so boring, Elise. No wonder you're always in a such bad mood, Elise. Oh, I'll tell you who's always in a bad mood, you little... Oh, we're gonna beat some children, I guess. Please, Elise, come play with us. She won't. She's a coward. Coward! Coward! Oh, I'll show you the coward. Give me that. Wait, what's happening? How did you do that, Elise? Damn. Showed up those kids. Good. No, we're not doing that. We just killed them. That's what we did instead. Oh, she's good. You did it from so far away, Elise. You're making too much of it, you brats. Your arms are longer. That's why. Cheater. You're a cheater. You asked me to play, kiddos. Why, you... Nah, I really am gonna punch the shit out of these kids. I'm gonna beat their ass. I'm gonna punch them and kick them? What the hell? I mean, Elise is gonna do it, so it's fine. Who's that? Wait a second. What are you doing here, Melly? Eek. It, Elise, I'm doing nothing. Nothing at all. Stuffing yourself full of Mrs. Lisbeth's apples again, are you? Oh, but they're, they're really sweet, Elise. Keep your grubby hands off me, Mindy. It, your loss. Honestly, based, because you should be taking some of these apples. Kind of weird that she's eating the goat's apples, but no, we're not helping you. Sorry, lady. I don't need to. Oh, but we will buy some bread if she paid me 40 bucks. Looking cheeky again today, dearie. I'm buying. So I did get four. No, no, I didn't get 40. I only got 30, right? 30, 31. They paid me thirty-one dollars? No, thirty, thirty-two. Cause I had nine coins, so they paid me thirty-two bucks for a B. Thirty-two bucks for a B rank? That's pretty good. All right, I I'll take that. Thirty-two bucks for the B rank? Okay. I guess we'll buy some. I guess we'll buy some bread. We'll buy three? No, two bread. Yeah, we'll buy two bread. It's kind of a random number, 32. And then pretzel? I guess we'll buy pretzel, yeah. We'll buy pretzel, sure. Just in case we need it. And then matches, I think we're fine on right now. He's spreading misinformation. He's just lying out here. See you, Granny. 32. That's pretty much what I just got paid, so... I got 32 bucks for B rank. Working on a Sunday again, Elise. Ought to keep myself fed, I'd say. Say, Elise, we've been considering rebuilding these homes. These piles of rubble? What for? I told you, fellas. Now, Soul and Kieferberg will give it the time of day. I don't see how it would be worth the hassle, that's all. It's such a shame. They're sitting right by the village square, too. But who would choose to settle in Kieferberg, of all places? Come now, folks. We don't rebuild our own town, who will? You're right, Gustav. This is our home, after all. 
Pip and I never managed an A thus far, though. Nah, I gotta get an A. I gotta get an A. I gotta get an A. I have to now. There's no swaying you two, is there? I mean, I like Gustav. Gustav, best guy? Best male character so far? Please don't betray me, Gustav. Damn it. It's over here still. So that brimstone is still there, but I guess the hole closed up. I wonder if that's going to open up again. And why is the fucking priest going in there, dude? Questions, but no answers. We didn't. We kind of glossed over that, but chat, what the hell was that, by the way? Why was there a pleb in there? You know what I'm talking about. You know what a pleb is. Thing with the big nose, flappy little arms. Only Pokemon events in Australia? I wish we had Pokemon events in Canada. But we got nothing. Lucky. <laughs> there she is. Um, I'll spend some time with her. Yeah. Elise. I'm so glad you made the time. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what was that laugh, bro? What was that laugh? <laughs> Why was that the creepy, like, creepy, like, otaku laugh, dude? I was curious about the maypole, I suppose. Come now, I've been picking some flowers. Won't they wilt if they pick if you pick them up now? <laughs> uh, I'm still playing with the colors. Papa's lending me a, a hand to dress the maypole. Mrs. Marilee and Mrs. Linda, too. <laughs> Freya! Might as well invite all of Kieferberg to dress it at this rate. Oh, right! Why don't you help, too, Elise? Gotcha, where if you spend 30 bucks at the supermarket, you get a cute little cardboard Pokemon standy. I mean, I guess that's kind of cute. I don't know if that, that's really an event, but I guess so. Me? Uh... You could spend the night on Friday, and we could do all do it together. Mm. Oh, Ginger would love Umbreon. I'm not too certain. It would be so much fun to have you. I'm not so good with that kind of thing, Freya. Huh? Oh, it's wonderful! I knew Daisy would suit you best. <laughs> Freya! <laughs> Alright. What do you say, Elise? Do you want to stay the night? I suppose I could, but... Wait, wait, she just told us to stay the night? Excuse me, we're gonna turn her down? We're in... It's alright if you don't want to, silly. That's not what I... You don't fancy me much, do you, Elise? She just straight up said, let's fuck. She just straight up said, let's fuck to my face. And then when... And then when Elise was, like, kind of mid about it, she just said, you don't want to fuck me, do you? That just happened. This game's fucking horny, dude. Freya. All I want is to be good friends with you, despite everything. Oh, never mind. Maybe I just everything I said is a lie. I do too, you know. <laughs> I'm just trying to make you feel for me or anything of the sort. For goodness sake. That's not it, Freya. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean... I didn't even say anything yet. Oh, but I truly didn't mean to. For first, first reactions are all that matters, anyways. Okay, this is a date, okay? If you're sleeping over on a date, you're fucking. I, I don't know what to say, man. Don't be a virgin, I guess, is what I'll say. You're always overcompensating. It makes you seem disingenuous. <laughs> that game off is really mean, but I'm just joking. Don't worry. Me and my homies used to have sleepovers all the time. It's all good. We didn't... We didn't do anything weird. Lease? Or did we? Socks on, boys. I mean, as long as you say no homo by the end of it, it's fine. You don't have to worry about anything. I'm glad we're friends, Freya. I truly am. Yet, you keep trying to please me day in, day out. It's not what I meant to do, Elise. I wish you treat me more as a friend, Freya. Friend zoned. Damn. Rather than someone you owe an apology to. Please. 
I'll be using that ointment you made me, alright? Never meant to overcompensate. For goodness sake. Yet you shower me with gifts every day of the week. Don't do that to anyone else. What am I supposed to think? I know. But... That's because I care for you, Elise. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Not that laugh, dude. <laughs> There's a reason why you're the only one, silly. Hey, yo, she got some riz on her. Okay, alright. Anyhow, it's getting quite late, isn't it? So Elise is a player, confirmed, right? Is everything alright, Elise? You're red as a beet! <laughs> Why, it is getting quite late. What are you laughing at? See you later, Elise. See you around, Elise. For goodness sake. For goodness sake. Yo, achievement heart piece acquired. Achieve one heart with someone. Okay. Big dub. Big dubs chats. Big dubs. Oh, fuck. We ate more food. All right. Romantic dates. You get a love heart after every successful date. Check your progress in the relationships menu. Okay. So now we gotta go on another date, right? We gotta go on another date. Wait, that wasn't open before. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. The woodland. Can we go to the woodland now? Okay, well, let's go. Let's go on that date. I mean, let's see, let's two times some girls. Am I right, Chan? To be fair, I don't. I don't think they're dating yet. It's like they're calling them dates, but we're just hanging out. We're just, you know, feeling, seeing around. You know, seeing if that'll work. Yeah, we're gonna save. There you are, Flock. Have to be nice being a goat, huh? Not one care in the world. Oblivious to everything. Kind of rude, but okay. He's a goat. He still has to worry about eating and shit. Literally, he has to worry where he shits. Okay, boys, let's date the witch. There she is. I'll spend some time with her. Yeah. I think we gotta wrap up stream soon, anyways. There you are, Rose and Marine. Elise. I didn't know you'd be back so soon, Elise. Huh. Is it Elise or Elise, by the way? I still ought to head back to town, mind you. What are you doing standing out here? <laughs> oh, just waiting for the stars to come out is all. Hmm. A little too early for stars, don't you think? I find it helps me air out my thoughts. Mm -hmm. Air out your thoughts, you say. I'm waiting for the waxing crescent. It's important I set my sight on what's to come. The sooner the better. What do you mean, Rosemarine? Oh, that's... You see, Elise? <laughs> that, that's a good shot. What the hell? I've dreamt about you before, about Kieferberg too. Okay, this is the Riz approach, okay? Last night, or... I know this may sound strange, but... I didn't quite stumble upon Kieferberg by accident. What do you mean? Do you believe in fate, Elise? I don't know. I've never given it much thought. Then you most likely wouldn't believe what I have to say, but... It's fate, Elise. She's fucking French, dude. Vin's been hiding it. She's French. I'm gonna have to break my own rule on this one. Talk to French person. I've always known my fate was with you, Elise. What? Huh? How's this gonna work out? 
It's too soon to be having this conversation, if I'm honest. Hmm. I meant to wait until you were ready, but... You need to riz me up a little bit more, okay, Rose and Marie? And you can't just be like, you're mine. I mean, maybe some... Okay, some girls like that. Some girls like when you just, like, kind of... When you're just like, hey, you're mine now. You're my girl. Hey, chat, you're mine. You're all mine. Like that, you know? I don't understand, Rosemarine. Ready for what? You'll know in time. For goodness sake. What is that, threat? What's with all this mystery? Out with it, Rosemarine. What are you trying to tell me? It took me quite some time to make sense of it myself, but... Everything's feeling so strangely nostalgic to me. I do like that, but not when Clock does it. <laughs> hey, get over here. Nostalgic, you say? Oh, that's... Your name, your voice, your home, this breeze even. All that surrounds you. So much of it feels like home to me. That's how I talk to my homies when they're around. I'm just like, hey, get over here. Let's kiss. And then we kiss. And then we say, no homo. That's not possible, Rosemarine. It's you the stars told me about, Lise. I'm certain now. Never in my life have I ever heard such nonsense, and yet... I'm covered in goosebumps. <laughs> I can't tell you don't believe one word of what I just said. Rose and Marine. Rose and Marine, I... Kinda did. I think the Riz kinda worked on her. I think I'll stay out here for a little while longer if that's alright. <laughs> I promise I won't be late for supper. Uh... Alright. Don't stay out here too long, you hear? Yes. I won't, I won't. Yo, okay, big. What does that say? Liebes Brewis? Liebes, Liebes Brewis? Liebes Brewis? Huh. I don't know what that means. Love to know. Chat, you know? Okay, now it's nighttime. Hey, what is that next tile? Oh god, we gotta eat some bread. We gotta eat some bread, chat. Where the hell am I? Also, let's eat some bread. Let's get this girl some bread. All right. Use. No, no, no. Let's eat the bread. Let's eat two bread, I guess. Liebes Brewis. I love it. Hydrate. Okay. Ah, some good water. Make sure you guys are staying hydrated while watching, okay? This is a pretty long stream. I'd like to add, you know, maybe just make sure you're getting your water in. Oh, we're just, like, right next to the house, though. Oh, I'm finally done with work for today. <laughs> we really didn't work very hard. I'd best head over to Mrs. Gretel's to see Lib Kuchin. Wait, what? Have dinner with Rose and Marine. Wait, what? What did she just say? What? Don't forget, meet Lib Kuchin at the bakery. Have dinner with Rose and Marine next in the story. Wait, what should I do, chat? Should I meet Lib Kuchin? Fuck the goat, man. What am I doing talking to a goat? What are you not doing? Chugging my coffee too bitter. Okay, but this is gonna pass time, right? That's gonna pass time. Okay. Yeah. Not gonna lie, I like the saving in Pocket Mirror a little bit more, just because it was faster. Always meet Leb. Stop back seating, okay? God. <laughs> uh, we love Leb. True enough, I guess. <laughs> oh, dude.
Oh, I'm not gonna lie, that <laughs> she looked kind of like a ghost or something. Is this? Who is this? There you are, Lepkuchen. You're a little too happy to see me, aren't you? Oh, I thought today would never end. That's all. Do you look tired, Elise? These folks will be the death of me, that's what. Bro, why are you... What are you saying? Fretting over this witch nonsense day and night. It would never happen, then. It would just never happen, okay? You know they're rather superstitious, Elise. Well, you're buying into it now, too. What's next? We all sleep in the church together like chickens in a coop. In a coop? Elise. It's all nonsense, Leb. Everyone's losing their wits. Here's your bread, Elise. Free bread. Nice. Why are they use why are they marking the bread with like a demonic symbol though? Did you give me two bread? Yo, I gotta keep dating Leb, never mind. Did you make too much today or something? I felt you could use a little more than usual tonight. Nice. I could take a kangaroo chant. I could take a kangaroo. You need to look after yourself, Elise. Leb's always had a talent to figure things out, but. Is this her intuition again, or... Move along, at least before it gets late. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Can I buy bread? Oh, I actually can. I guess she left it on the sill. I'm waking up this poor old lady in the middle of the night. It's always lovely seeing you, Elise. Um, I'm selling. What can I sell? Grapes? I don't want to sell any of this. Can't sell any of that. I can sell the ointment for, for a bread. Wow. I could get a bread out of this. Hmm. Nah, I'm good. It's fine. Let's see you, Granny. I could sell my ointment, but I don't think that's worth it. Okay, let's go talk to uh let's go talk to Rosemarine again. I think she meant to say word, but she mistyped. But you guys can be a bunch of worms. That's fine. I'd still love you guys. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Okay, save. I just wish the save was a little bit faster. He was so good in in Pocket Mirror, okay? It was like perfect. You just hit XX and exit. It was perfect. Please. Oh, I don't know that meme. Oh, then, then yeah, I don't know that. No. I just know the would you love me if I was a worm meme. Alice, welcome back. <sighs> I brought some bread. Let's settle down and eat. All we eat is bread. There's a problem here, chat. There's a problem. Would you like me to start making dinner for us? To oh, sorry. Would you like me to start making dinner for us tonight? Tomorrow, at least? Hmm. That's not a bad idea in itself, but... Yo, free, free cook as well? How am I to know you won't make a mess of it? Last thing I want is to spend my evenings in the outhouse. <laughs> wow. I hope you know I'm a proper cook, at least. Never once did my sweet granny disapprove of anything I prepared. Oh my god, we're the same. It's an old Tumblr meme. I, I actually pride myself that I know a few old Tumblr memes. But not as much as you guys, so that's true enough. Well, I suppose it can't do much harm. All right. On that note, Rosemary, you're just sleep up in the attic from now on. Can't have you hanging around the old granary and bringing all the dust and cobwebs inside. Oh, but I... Well, I can clean it out for you, Elise. It's really no trouble. Hm. Rosemary is really just the fucking... The uwu-ified girl in this one. I've had my fill of running about looking for you day and night. But... See, me and Ginger actually use Tumblr because we're old. 
But the memes do travel over everywhere else. Oh, Elise, I wouldn't want to be a bother. Oh, shush it! And I wouldn't want you nesting with the mice and the geckos. You're sleeping in the attic, and that's final, you hear? I'm letting you sleep inside where it's perfectly warm and... Did you hear that, Rosemarine? Hear what? I'm taking the broom. You stay here, just in case. Yeah, I am old. It's true. I am literally Grandfather Clock. Okay, time to save again. We're definitely saving a lot here, but that's okay. Okay, what's happening here? What's happening? What the fuck is that? A cell phone? I'm going out until I figure out what this is. Excuse me? Is there... Wait, that's coming from my left. Was I not supposed to go through- Oh! Oh, I saw something! Dude! What the fuck? It's that girl. It's you. Eek. It was going through left and right ears. It was very confusing. That's why. You guys didn't notice that? It wasn't that it was going through left and right? Oops. Eek. Muffy. Is this the girl that was eating those apples? Please spare me, Elise. Muffy. What in the Lord, Lord's name are you doing here, Miffy? You know. I was out on a stroll, I, I swear, I swear my auntie's name. Is that so? Ah, uh, and you just so happen to hide behind my house, I see. Who, who doesn't? You sneak about ho folks' homes every now and then too, don't you? Huh? What? What are you doing here, Mandy? Tell me right now, or I'll scrub your mouth with soap this very minute. Whoa! <laughs> Yeah, we're wrapping up stream soon. It's getting quite late, isn't it, Elise? I'd best... Out with it! <laughs> yeah, Vin, you should go to sleep. I saw her. That girl you're housing, Elise. <laughs> you saw nothing, Molly. Is it Molly, Muffy, or Millie? What, what am I saying her name? <sighs> 99. She's, she's not around from here. Even I can tell. <laughs> Whoa, what is that face, dude? You were having supper together and everything, Elise. Why is her mouth like that? Is this the horny character? You keep your mouth shut, Mubby, or I'll... <laughs> okay, I just keep changing her name, apparently. Why don't you share some of that bread you've got, Elise? I might keep quiet if you do. Oh, I should have guessed that's what you wanted. Give her this ointment. I have to give her some of my bread? Okay, fine. Give her some bread, I guess. If I hear as much as a word about this, Molly. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Good night. Thanks for the help today. Really appreciate that. Makes the fun... Thanks for popping in to the stream. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Golly, Elise, why don't you bring me a pretzel tomorrow? Oh Out my god. It. Mouth shut or I'll throw you in the well. <laughs> Suspicion down. How did that make me less suspicious, honestly, that I'm willing to give her bread? I feel like that's more suspicious. And don't come back, or else. For goodness sake! <laughs> For goodness sake! This is the last thing I needed. I'm sorry, I. Is she gone? Mm. This could be bad, Rosemarine. Uh, I'm sorry. Well, Lisa, I genuinely didn't see her. I would have told you if I had. Uh, don't you start fretting now, too. Don't you, do you think she'll tell anyone? Uh, if she does, we could be not uh, roommates anymore. In trouble. I know, Rosemarine. I'm sorry, I... It's Rosemarine. Shush it, you. <laughs> Shush it, you. I'm heading back inside. Uh, yes. And your name is what I say it is. Uh, yes. She says good things about you to the town if you give her what she wants. That's why it went down. Ah, okay. Muffy's spying on you. Fulfill her daily requests for food items to keep her from snitching and raising suspicion. 
Oh, okay, perfect. That tutorial just told me. Mind what you say and do. You're best to avoid raising suspicion towards Elise or bear the consequences. What are they gonna do? Burn me at the stake? What are they gonna think? I'm a witch? Okay. Oh, my house is creaky as fuck. Elise, I'm heading off to bed, Rosemarine. I can spend the night in the greenery if you'd like. No, I meant when I said you're sleeping in the attic. I'll meet you upstairs. <laughs> yes. Okay, well then. <laughs> Uh, all right. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, now that I know the threat is being burned alive at the stake, maybe that's not so great. Where's the attic? Is the attic's door through my room? You left that goat in the granary, I'm hoping. Uh, of course. <laughs> I left the door ajar so he can go out and about if he wants. It makes you think he'll stay put. <laughs> Why, the bed I made him, of course. You ought to see it, Elise. I'm not going out of my way to see a goat's hay bed in Rosemarine. Up you go. You need to make your bed, too. Where is it? Oh. You'll make do, I'm certain. Oh, it's perfect. I'll get you a blanket, too. Can't have you sleeping on hay. Why not? For goodness sake. You're not a goat, Rosemarine. <laughs> could be a thief, yet you're trusting me with a blanket? For goodness sake. I don't see what's so funny. Please. You truly are kind, Elise. I can see that clearly now. Shush it, you. Oh, shush. I'll be glad to take that blanket, Elise. I'll get you some matches, too, and a candle. <laughs> Thank you, Elise. It's bedtime now. I need some rest. Good night, Rosemary. Mm -hmm. Good night, Elise. Very odd. This is a horror game, right? <laughs> Okay, bedtime. For real. Uh, for goodness sake. Please. What am I getting myself into? First I agreed to house Rosemarine. Now Miffy's caught wind of it too. Uh, Best make sense of all this by tomorrow. If only I could leave this town. Go somewhere far, far away from here. A place where I never have to fret about money or going hungry. Uh, like a castle or a palace. Somewhere. I can live the life I deserve. Deserve? Alright. Alright. Running. Now, what is this? I saw this earlier and I was like, what the fuck is that? Dude, why is nighttime full of. This is creepy, dude. Where... where am I? What is this a this? dream? Ooh. Hello? Explore the room. What? Golden girl. Rebirth. That's what I wished for long, long ago. You wanted to be reborn? Somewhere safe, somewhere far, far away. Went through all of their trials, gathered all of his gifts. And? Indeed, I was reborn. My wish was granted yet. Yet? To think I would end up like this. Wait! What was that? She's still there. Okay, never mind, she's gone. Find a golden maiden. Hey, we got some grapes. Oh! What was that, dude? Chest? It's locked, it seems. Oh, and I bet there's something nice inside, too. What? I feel like I'm in a prince's bedroom. If only I could live here, just like I've always dreamed. <laughs> oh! Oh! Why? I didn't get acquired one silver key. Why did the game just do that to me? About using items, I'm here. Dude, the game just forced me to take a hit? It's so bright, but there's no flame. Intricately designed golden lamp stands by the bedroom door. It's bulb shining bright. Dude, the game just forced me to get smacked. Oh, what a give to sleep here every night. Spacious bed stands in a corner. Silky sheets are protected by a counterpane and burdened in a golden thread. I'm like running now because I don't want to get smacked. I'm locked in here, I suppose. Can't say I mind it much if I'm honest. Okay, so now I can use my item. Right? 
Is the key there? Oh, it is. Okay. Use. Doesn't seem to be working, huh? Wait, what? Really? Are you certain this is velvet? Upholstered in luxurious red velvet, the broad sofa rests by a marble table center. Can I use the window? It's so bright I can hardly see. Blinding warm light pierces the window's glass panes, cradling the room in a welcoming glow. Does it just use it or no? Yeah, okay. Never mind. I know. Can't go from the top to the bottom, okay. Let's see. Oh goodness, so many dresses. Another key? I wonder what it's for. Probably the door. Golden key, okay. Leave the room, okay. Let's use the golden key. Sure. Such a long corridor. It truly feels as though I'm inside a palace. No, not the laughing. Not the giggling. <laughs> Such a strange statue. Marble statue of a serpent wearing a golden crown. Its nameplate reads Azeel. Azeel. Such a strange statue. Crow wearing a golden crown. Its nameplate reads Vree. Sure. I don't think those are English characters. Okay, leave those lights on. Ooh, oh, I'm gonna save. Yep, I can't see anything. Blinding crimson glow pierces the window's glass panes, tinting the room in reddish hues. Okay, we're gonna save for sure. I guess we'll finish this day before we start another, before we end, okay? I have a bad feeling about this. Do you? That's ah, fine. I'm sure it's fine. What the fuck is going on in here? What, what in the Lord's this? name is this place? What are those things? Candles? Feeling lost? Don't forget to turn on your lantern and keep an eye out. How do I turn on the lantern? Is it that? What, is, what button was it again? Oh, it was triangle. Okay. What am I doing? Blowing candles, eh? Phantasm key. It's a key. This is what would get me out of here, I'm certain. Is there anything else in this place? Besides the key? Fuck, fuck, fuck. What's this say? They're all in a different language. I can't make sense of any of these titles. Shit, 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 shit. Can I get to that end? There is something there. Acquired bandages. Did I? I really went through all that just to get some bandages? What is this? That's me? Wait, no. That's me? Shit. It's jammed. Could try to pry it open, but... Sure, Elise. You're a strong woman. Uh... Uh... Evil? What's this? The key to one's dream is found within oneself. As for yours, it's in this very room, the core of your innermost desire. It's not knowledge you seek, but gold bathed in glory. Oh. Okay. Okay. Oh, shit. Need to wait. Oh, there's no 
another chest. Loot! Phantasm key. It's a key. Do I need more than one? Oh shit. Okay, can I... Four keyholes, that means there's four keys. Four keys? What? Oh, there's... Wait, what? Oh, oh, almost. Oh, there's another one. Okay. Lurker to chatter ratio is insane, I know. Kind of true. It's jammed. I could try to pry it open, but... Yeah, forced open, yeah. Ugh, I hate that sound. Phantasm key, okay. It's a key. Okay, but I still need another key, I think, right? Dude, why are there just evil candles, dude? What is this? What does that even mean, bro? Different languages. I've opened that chest. Did I get four keys? Oh, whoop. whoops. Did I get four keys? No, I only have three. There. There's no chest there, I should say. Something here, maybe? Lantern, emerald brooch? Use? Doesn't seem to be working, huh? Last key is a little obtuse. It's the note said it's what she wants covered in gold. It's gotta be something to do with this mirror or this painting, right? Not good for her mind, but whatever. I might need some help with this last key. I think I need the light. I, I don't think I I don't think it's that, right? Need the 
open that one. You can't jump anywhere. Such a big sofa, if only. Luxurious blue velvet. It's golden. Oh, oh. I see it. There's something on the back of this shelf. To reach out my arm to get it, but... Reach for it. This is... I see it, I see it, I see it. Got the key. Okay. It's a key. That's what will get me out of here, that's for certain. Okay, okay. Thanks for the hint. Because I, I was looking for a chest, so that's that's why you don't notice, right? But then I remember him, did, him saying you need to look for, like, gold. For keys. Okay. So... Use the keys. Right? This is it! This is it! It worked! Nice. It's too easy, chat. What Where is this? am I? Must be dreaming. Uh, fire. At least that light is still following us. Oh. Is this okay? Uh, I do want to go back to my village, I think. <laughs> She's so cute. What the fuck? No worries, guys. We're going to wrap up the stream very soon anyways. As soon as this segment is over. I'm just a little... What the fuck going on? Can I run? I guess I can run. Oh, no. No, I can't. <gasps> Hello? Hurry now, hurry now. We're late for his banquet. What are you? Hurry, hurry. Is this the pumpkin? Is this a baby pumpkin? Which means that's the strange boy. Ha ha. Oh yeah. Hey, pumpkin. I love the pumpkins, don't worry. The jack-o'-lanterns are great. <laughs> oh god, that's not a pumpkin on my left. What is that cat? And that's his, like, puppet show. Montag. Monday. Another less piece of bread. She's tired. I need to get her some food. I will, I will. What the fuck happened in the... What the fuck happened? A dream. That left me feeling a little queasy. Huh. Rose and Marine? Are you there? She's most likely still asleep anyway. No point in waking her this early, I suppose. Get ready for work. Collected fireflies, one. What's happening? Oh, is it because she's tired? We don't have any more bread, though, do we? Oh, no, we do. Any different. Oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> Everything's all fucked up because I was hungry. And she's awake. And she's in love with me. Good morning, Elise. I would have got a head start on breakfast if I knew you'd be waking up this early. For goodness sake. Since when have you been up? <laughs> oh, I'm always up and about before daybreak. I can't sleep in if I try. Hmm. I didn't notice you coming down from the attic. I brought the ladder up with me last night so I wouldn't wake you. The hatch doesn't squeak if you do it slowly, right? I took my shoes off and used the ladder to shut it back up. Easy. <laughs> You're smarter than you look, huh? <laughs> I'd look as smart as I am, Elise. Is that so? Mm. Anyhow, I'm heading off to the garden. The garden? You mean the field just outside? Mm. It's that obvious that I haven't touched it in years. Been working like a dog since Granny Holy passed, but... 
Holly Pass, but now I have you to fret about, too. I can't sit on my hands forever, can I? Please. What? You'd rather starve? Join me as a maid of all work, perhaps? <laughs> Truly are kind, aren't you? Shush it, you! Shush. I'm heading out to see what I can do about the garden. I'll call you in for breakfast for in a moment, then. What's golden on my table? Oh, she just had bread? Free bread? Okay, we will do the garden, but we're gonna save, actually. Okay. Because we're gonna stop playing. So, this has been episode one, I guess, of... This has been episode one of Little Goody Two Shoes. I'm actually pretty excited to play this. Um, it seems like a lot of fun. Interesting. More... Obviously, the horror element is, like, less than Pocket Mirror, I guess. But it was still good. I still liked it. Um, I still like P Pocket Mirror a lot. I like this a lot, too, so far. It's interesting. It's more funny, I would say. A lot of dialogue, obviously. I think this is going to be a really long series. So, uh, better strap in. Uh, I'll be uploading this alongside other games and series. Don't worry if you're more interested in the visual novels and the random games. I'm going to still play them. This will just be every once in a while. Um, and I don't think I'll be going for all endings all endings just because I think it's pretty hard to do that. Psychological horror is the best. Yeah, I definitely think this is going to be a psychological kind of horror game. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching. This has been Clock. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like and if you want to see more of the series or other games, subscribe to the channel, okay? I really appreciate it and it helps me out a lot and you'll get to see more of my videos. Um, yeah, and yeah, thanks for watching. To all the current subs, thank you so much. You're great. I loved it. Chat, Twitch chat, you're awesome too. I'll see you guys next time, okay? See ya. Peace. It's been Clock.